It is perfectly safe for dogs to eat almond flour, as long as pet owners ensure no ingredients are toxic to dogs added in. Some dogs may find it hard to digest baked goods containing almond flour, so it is suggested that they only be fed products baked with almond flour occasionally as a treat. Can dogs eat almond flour? Dogs can eat almond flour. Many recipes for dog treats you find online will call for this specific flour. Unfortunately, although it is not toxic to dogs, many dogs may find that it causes them some digestive issues. Almond flour by itself and in small amounts is generally considered acceptable for your dog to consume. However, many say that eating in excess could lead to dehydration and liver failure, as almond flour may lead to digestive issues. Despite this, almond flour, one of the non-grain flours dogs can eat, is high in protein but low in carbohydrates. Is almond flour toxic to dogs? Almond flour has been said not to be harmful to dogs, as long as they are not overfed. Baked goods made with almond flour should not include ingredients that will harm dogs, such as high amounts of sugar and butter. How is almond flour harmful? Almond flour is made from blanched almonds, which contain multiple nutritional benefits, including proteins, fiber, vitamins, phosphorus, vitamin E, and other essential nutrients with numerous health benefits that your puppy or dog may need in their diet. When looking at what almond flour to use to make baked goods for your furry friend, you should check to ensure that it does not contain harmful additives, especially xylitol, a sweetener that is outright toxic to dogs. Almond flour poisoning. Dogs can be fed too much almond flour. When this happens, they may show signs of being hyperactive and aggressive. Many almond flours will also contain salt, which can be dangerous for dogs in large quantities. In excess, this can cause your dog to experience heart and kidney issues. If your dog eats almond flour, it is essential to watch them to ensure that they do not have a bad reaction. Can dogs eat baked goods made from almond flour? Dogs can eat treats made from almond flour, but dog owners should watch and make sure they only have a bite or two. There are many recipes on the internet for great, healthy homemade dog treats. Depending on your dog's diet, we suggest speaking to a vet about what giving your dog almond flour may do. Their answer will depend on the dog's specific diet and any food allergies. Can dogs eat almonds? Dogs cannot eat almonds. Although almonds are not toxic to dogs like other nuts, they are hard to digest in their whole form and should not be given to your dog. What happens if dogs eat almonds? Almonds themselves will cause your dog to experience gastric intestinal distress. If this happens, your dog may experience diarrhea, gas, lethargy, general discomfort, and vomiting. Almonds have also been known to cause obstructions, blocking intestines, windpipes, and the esophagus, many times in small dogs. If not treated, this can be fatal. Additionally, almonds are high in fat and, if your canine's diet is high in fat already, can put your furry friend at risk for pancreatitis. How many almonds can dogs consume? Dogs should not eat almonds, but they take about 7 or 8 almonds to have potentially harmful or life-threatening effects. How can you process almonds? Since almonds can contain toxins, they must be processed before they are used for almond flour. To do this, you must bake or boil them. Boiling destroys toxins. Different flours can dogs eat them? There are many different flour options and so many dog treat recipes. Here are some of the most popular flours to bake with and whether or not they are okay to use for your dog. All-purpose flour. All-purpose flour is one of the most widely used flours out there, with thousands upon thousands of recipes using it. A mixture of different wheat varieties, this flour has a little bit of nutritional value but does not contain the whole grains found in some others. One drawback to this kind of flour is that it has a protein called gluten, which can be terrible for dogs since many cannot process it. Bleached versus unbleached. When looking at all-purpose flour, it is essential to note that there are two kinds, bleached and unbleached. Bleached flour goes through a chemical process used to whiten it, while unbleached does not. Therefore, if you are looking for flour to feed your dog, you should always go with unbleached. Can dogs consume all-purpose flour? Although this regular flour will not hurt your dog, it really won't do anything for them, either. Therefore, it is recommended that if you can, you should avoid feeding this flour to your dog and find a flour that may have a little more nutrition. Whole Wheat Flour Whole wheat flour is perfectly safe for dogs to eat. Whole wheat is one of a few whole grain flours, and it is packed with all sorts of nutrients that will be great for your dog, like vitamins, minerals, fiber, and protein. On top of that, whole wheat flour also contains antioxidants. This makes it an excellent choice for your dog, with numerous health benefits. 
What makes this different than all-purpose? Whole wheat flour is different from white flour regarding nutritional value. Although both are wheat flour, white flour does not use the whole wheat kernel, the endosperm, germ, and bran. This means that it will lack the benefits of whole wheat flour. Whole wheat flour uses every single part of the grain, which means that the flour retains the full nutritional value. Coconut flour. Coconut flour is made from the pulp of the coconut being ground into a fine powder. It is an excellent choice for dogs since it has high plant proteins and fiber levels. Additionally, coconut flour is a gluten-free flour, great for dogs who are intolerant to gluten. Unfortunately, this type of flour also contains much less vitamin C, vitamin B6, potassium, and calcium than other flour. When it comes down to it, coconut flour is one of the best flour options for your dog. It is a naturally gluten-free flour and contains several vital nutrients such as vitamin C, which improves energy. It also helps your dog's immune system glucose generation and helps regulate RBC. On top of that, coconut flour also contains phosphorus and calcium. Quinoa flour. Quinoa flour is fantastic for your dog to eat. Not only that, but you can also find quinoa seeds in many high-quality dog foods you will find in pet stores. Quinoa is full of nutritional benefits, just like coconut flour. It is gluten-free for, high in fiber, and contains high levels of vitamin B2. This helps maintain carbs in the body and boost your canine's metabolism. This flour also does not contain any trans fats and can be an excellent source of fatty linoleic acid, which is vital for your dog's growth and will help prevent skin injuries. Oat flour. A great choice of flour for your dog, oat flour contains antioxidants that will help support their immune system. Oats are dense with nutritional value, so you can be sure that your dog will be getting a lot of vitamins, protein, fiber, and minerals, which will all make sure that your pet's organs are functioning correctly. Lastly, oats are low in sugar and gluten-free. Brown rice flour. Brown rice flour is made when unholed brown rice is ground up. It's a great option to use for dog treats since it is high in calcium, folate, zinc, and fiber. It has been noted that although this is a great flour to use, brown rice flour can be gritty and will make a denser dough than other flour. Therefore, some suggest that you mix this type of flour with another gluten-free option like oat flour, which will reduce the grittiness. What flour should I use for my dog? All of the flours listed above are great options for your dog's food, but there are a few that stand out. In reality, highly processed flours not derived from whole grains are not usually good for your dog. If you are looking for flour to use, looking up homemade dog treat recipes, you should look for flours made from whole wheat and oats since they are more nutrient dense. Can dogs consume other almond products? Over the years, almonds have been used for quite a few different things. Let's go over some almond products you may find and whether your canine can eat them. Almond butter. Almond butter is perfectly safe for dogs to eat and use when baking dog treats. However, it is essential to note that not all dogs will have an easy time digesting almond butter, and you should monitor their intake. Almond milk. Since processed almonds are safe in moderation for dogs to consume, almond milk is safe for pets as long as they have it in moderation. Almond meal. Almond meal is also safe for dogs to eat, although it should also only be given to them in moderation. The best dog treats. Finding the best dog treat recipes for your dog can be a challenge, but it doesn't have to be. Try to find recipes that use whole grain flour. Other ingredients commonly found in homemade dog treats are coconut oil and peanut butter since they are both good for dogs. Some treats may even call for soy milk, which is okay for dogs in moderation, and a good protein source found in many pet foods. However, soy is also one of the top allergens for dogs, so it is crucial to monitor them if they eat something with soy. If you are giving your dog new foods, always make sure that they do not have an adverse reaction. Always store the treats in a sealed container that your dog cannot get into so that they do not eat too many. Dogs can eat almond flour. Although feeding almond flour to your dog may not be the most nutritious option, almond flour is not toxic to your furry friend, and they will not get sick.